2011 when it first happened, I was actually teaching and I saw something come across the television because I was a journalism teacher. I was sitting in a preschool classroom teaching pre-K and one of the staff members was on their break and the TV was on and all she just was hollering, the towers was hit, the towers was hit. As America commemorates the 20th anniversary of 9-11, the Continuous Learning Center in Camden is honoring local first responders with this first ever Hero Day. Students at the Continuous Learning Center in Kershaw County Virtual Academy got a full experience of why 9-11 is so significant to our country. The day began with a moment of silence at 846 to mark the day of the attack. Then the students heard presentations from first responders and participating agencies. The day wrapped up with students watching 9-11 videos and writing thank you cards, which would be delivered to heroes who participated. Most of our students, they aren't familiar with 9-11 because they weren't alive then. So that's our goal today, too, is to educate them about 9-11. Many people have lost their lives, and but it also shows what our first responders do and what they've done in that day of time. Blanket and Family's co-founder Annette Hammond shared with students a personal story about her aunt witnessing the attack as she was headed to work as a New York City police officer. Um, she was heading to work, about to go through the tunnel. Um, traffic just came to a halt and um, she got out to see what was going on and she just could see that there was a plane going into the Ten Towers. This is a day I believe her and no one else will ever forget one of the biggest days of everyone's life. In Camden, I'm Devin Johnson for Street Squad.